Hi everyone, I'm Ellen and I'm Mark. Yes, and we're from Living Clean and Dirty and we got a message from Curtis. Thank you for watching our previous videos about Pure Wash Pro. And he said, what are the pros and cons? Can you do a video on that? So Curtis, here this is for you and for the rest of everybody else. So why don't you explain the Pure Wash Pro, baby? So this is the Pure Wash Pro, this system right here. So you can see, for those of you just joining us, it's just cold water. Cold water goes in, does the magic. Cold water comes out and goes into the back of your washing machine. So this replaces soap, detergent. It's all done in here. There is no soap. There is no detergent. It is just pure wash pro. Right. And you can look it up. It's an entire ozone technology. Hospitals and hotels have been using it for like a gazillion years. Magic. So now it's uh, available to the public. Okay. So um, we have ours. I can't even begin to tell me how many years. They can probably tell us if they're yes. watching the video. Go back to the previous videos. I think there's a video on like when we first installed it. You can see we have it for many, many years. One of the pros is we don't buy detergent ever again. So now this is where it's a pro and a con. Mm -hmm. A lot of our pro and con list is going to be like sure. a pro and a con. So right. the pro is that you never have to buy detergent ever again. But the con is... No Tide Pods to snack on. No, that's not it. You have to trust that it's working, okay? You, you have to trust. You have to trust in the system. How many of us, raise your hands, because it's all of us, how many of us grew up with parents or ourselves? We do the laundry, we put in laundry detergent. So this is going to go again. This is like not flushing the toilet after you use the bathroom. This goes against everything that you have trained your brain to do. So you are not going to... Do the measuring with the scoop, that same scoop that everybody has, and throw the laundry detergent in. You're not going to do that. You're going to trust in the system. You're going to think outside of the box. You're going to think outside of the laundry box, so to speak. Mm -hmm. You're going to think outside of the box, and you're going to try something new. And if you're like us, you're going to love it, and you're never going to want to go back. Now, um, you're going to ask me, are my clothes clean? Yes. Um, <clears throat> it gets out, does it get out horrible stains? No, but neither did my laundry detergent. I still have to pre-treat stains whenever we do have them, but I had to do that anyway. So I don't know the difference. Um, but everything comes out smelling great, looking great. Yep. My clothes are not damaged. Yep. Um, uh, I, I have, you only have our opinion as a family. I haven't done studies on, you know, cleaning and washing one and washing the other. I have not noticed it to be a problem at all. Our clothes are clean. The only time, and it doesn't damage your clothes, that's your pro. The only time I did have a problem with damaging my, our clothes is something we did wrong. So when you first install the system, it will ask you if, um, and this is a really important thing, so don't get caught like we did. Do you have a top loader or a front loader? Right. And we had, <laughs> what did we have? We had, we had, a, we had a front loader. We had a Guess what I had it set to. Right. So we had a front loader for years. And then when we installed it, we set it and everything was fine. We decided to get a top loader when our front loader broke. That's right. Forgot all about the installation. We didn't think anything of it. And our clothes started to have weird stains. Permanent stains. I mean, I ruined the Permanent clothes. Permanent stains. They almost looked like, I had a dark blue shirt. And it almost had like a, like a bleach, like a bleach patch stain kind of thing. But that was... So after a while, that was on us. we were like, what are we doing wrong? And Mark looked it up and he goes, oh my God, it's right here on the internet. We forgot to I never, switch it. I never made the adjustment when we, we switched to a top loader from the front loader. The second we did that, we never had a problem ever again. Never. So please don't forget... It took us a while to figure that one out, too. Months. We ruined a lot of stuff. But it was purely our problem and we didn't know. And thank God for the Googles because you figured it out in like right. a nanosecond. So... um. The other pro is, so you're going to save money on detergent. Now, there are some people who just can't handle it. They just, they have to use detergent. Sure. You can use detergent. The detergent police is not going to come and break down your house and like your doors and be like, you're a dick. You're right. using detergent. You could do it. It's just, I'm telling you, like, there's no need. So, whatever. Um, the next thing I have is... Um, Thank you. I'm, I'm keeping a list. Okay. So I'm anal. Um, and I have an entire list here over. Oh, the good thing about not using detergent is a lot of the detergents have chemicals. So it's your state of mind. Also, I don't want the chemicals in my laundry mm -hmm. and it goes into the water, which is our drinking water. So, um, it depends how green you are on whether you want to use something like this, but you're keeping the chemicals from getting the water. 
The number one thing I noticed is the smell. Not only does it smell like amazing and electric, no joke, it's like lightning smell. It smells like, like after a lightning storm. Right, it's so clean. The, um, the good thing is I do laundry at night, especially because if you've read um, my blog, I put my energy on time of use and I pay cheaper for electric rates overnight. So um, I will put it in and then I'll fall asleep. And before the Pure Wash Pro, I would wake up in the morning and it smelled moldy and mildew and I'd have to wash it again, defeating the whole purpose. This you don't have to. For some reason, I don't it's know soap. what it does. It, no it, soap. it kills the bacteria. It's all, it kills germs, all that good stuff. And so you don't get, um, you don't get a mildew smell. So that's amazing. You know, before, before, before I met her, you know, when we do laundry, you do hot and cold. This, it's only cold. So there's even more savings right, right. there. There's savings on your electric bill and, mm -hmm. you know, um, and, and your water bill. Um, easy to install. Um, it's m the most important pro is it actually works. Okay. So it's worth it because it works and it's the, it's a great eco-friendly. It's probably the most eco-friendly tip in the laundry room I can give because you can move detergents to and more eco-friendly. And, and it just works. You it can works. you can buy the sheets and not the big plastic jugs so your plastic free you know there's all these things but like this is like this is like the dark green of the green movement. Sure. Um there are cons we have talked about it. Um it does cost money so you're going to initially have to pay it out. The other thing is um these cartridges. So these cartridges cost money and every couple of months, I don't know how many months, maybe every six is it, months. Is it depends. months or is it how many times you use it? Maybe like, no, no, I it's don't months? know. It, it depends on how often you do the laundry. When this starts turning colors, it starts turning pink and you can tell because it, there's a smell and it's like weird and you just check it every once in a while. You saw like this. There's this. a little, you can't see it from this angle, but there's a little window on well, the side here. Well, that's what it is, yeah. And you can see, you'll be able to see it right now. Looks like a boy. When it starts looking like a girl, then you know it's time to change it. So it's pretty simple. So um, they cost money for these cartridges, but I found a way around it. Thanks to another viewer, um, another follower, subscriber of ours on YouTube, who told me about a video where you can take these apart and then heat them up and reuse them. So you don't have to keep buying new ones. You heat them, when you heat them up, basically you're drying them out. These things, as they absorb moisture over time, that's when this color will start to go to pink. You can heat them up with, like a, like you put them in your oven to heat them up. There's, there's videos, everybody has a different way to do it. There's all different videos how to do it. In my garage, I have a, a heat gun, and so I was able to just like a, like a very high powered hair dryer, and able to clean it that way. And you know, the, I keep opening that. The entire process, start to finish, it was maybe 10, 15 minutes. Yeah. So um, I did find a workaround. So you don't have to keep spending money because they're not, they're not inexpensive. You know, they're not incredibly expensive, but you'll save money doing that. So that's our pro and con list. We hope you help. I, we helped you. I say maybe just, sorry, maybe just the one con is probably convincing your family members that it's okay that you're going to do laundry without using laundry detergent. Yeah. That's about it. Yeah. That's about it. Pretty much everybody's so used to it. They're like, you, know, like, you sure you, that clean? It's going to be gross. You're it's, just using water? Yeah. No, it's not it because works. there's technology. It, so it, it works. We haven't used laundry detergent in literally in years. 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 So make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. The Oh, here's another con. When your kid is about to go off to college like me, I now have to describe how to do laundry <laughs> using laundry detergent because she's so used to doing the laundry here. I know it's going to happen. She's going to go to college and she's never going to use laundry detergent detergent because she's going to be like, but there's a pure wash pro. That's going to be a problem. So make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel and you subscribe to our newsletter, livingcleananddirty.com. Make sure you like this and you make sure you comment. Tell us what you think you would like about it and you wouldn't like. And like I said, there's two other videos so you can take a look and see more videos about the pure wash pro. Thanks, Curtis. This was a great idea. Thanks. Well, thank you.